Okay, so I've had them just chilling in like the corner of my house by my TV and stuff. Um, kind of indirect sunlight, whatever, just in a safe area where I know that they're not going to get knocked over or anything. But um, this is one week after I sewed them. Yeah, uh, no progression or anything yet, but it should be another two weeks, three weeks maybe before we see anything from any of them, so yeah. Okay, so this is week like two or three of them being um, sewed. As you can see, this one has sprouted. It's honestly three weeks earlier than the time frame, which is crazy, so I have high hopes for the other ones. Um, this one was supposed to be the one that sprouted first, so hopefully it does. Um, yeah, I'm so excited. I just woke up this morning and I seen this out of nowhere and it looked, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. This is the red tree. Um, that's the blue one. So I'm really hoping that one sprouts too. I really want this one too. This is the only one, like if it doesn't sprout, I won't really care. But I'm so excited. Okay, doing another update. Let me get these gloves out of the way. Um, this guy is doing fantastic. I think it's currently week five. Um, I will have to give this a check back because I'm not exactly sure. But I was checking them out and look, this guy is about to sprout as well, which is so awesome. I'm so excited. Ah, oh my gosh. Yeah, no, he is doing great. He is doing so good. Look how pretty he is. I don't mean to misgender these trees, but for some reason, I'm just getting big he vibes, okay? Okay, so I forgot to do an update on some of the bonsai trees, and so far, the only one that really has stayed alive is the Royal Point Sienna. Um, he seems to be doing well, but I'm worried about whatever's happening here. This just developed a few days ago. I don't know what's going on. I read that it can be super tricky to keep a bonsai tree alive, and I didn't even think we were going to get one, to be honest, and I got one, so I'm pretty proud about it. Um, this is the red one, too, so I'm excited about that. I'm really disappointed that the purple one over there didn't um, do anything, but that's okay. You know, we got one out of, I don't know, a lot, but, but I'm excited. Um, I think it'd be easier to keep one alive than very many, so I think we're doing okay. These guys were supposed to sprout, like, probably almost a month ago now, and this one, I, I don't even know what happened to them, I'm going to be honest, but that's okay, we got one. Okay, and this is now the three-month update of this bonsai tree i mean look how beautiful this tree is becoming i am so shocked by the growth of this thing i truly thought that i was gonna get lucky if i even got one to sprout and i got three to sprout him being the first one and the other two um they sadly didn't make it past like an inch which is fine. I heard it's really hard to grow a bonsai tree. Um, he's even starting to grow a little bit of bark. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, it's... This tree is... Honestly, it's really cool to see. And um, I'm going to keep giving updates. But for this video, this is... This is going to be it. Um... Yeah, I mean, if you're trying to grow a bonsai tree or you're using a starter kit, don't be fooled. They do work. Look at this. This is, he's living, breathing proof. Look how beautiful. Look how beautiful this tree is. Um, It's got a little one that's coming off. And here's the thing too. I thought multiple times that when it, his um, little limbs were dying, when he first started to grow, because you can see little spots where other limbs have come off, like, right there and stuff i thought multiple times that he was gonna die and it's really just he's getting rid of his old stuff and growing new stuff just let him do what he's gonna do honestly i didn't really go by what the book said um book um i kind of just did whatever i thought would work like whatever i've been doing with my other plants i did with him and it worked i used 
the same soil that I used for those plants for him. Um, I've given him indoor plant food a couple of times, not a lot, but a little bit a couple of times. And I water him every time his soil gets like down here, you can feel it's dry all the way down here. That's when I water him again. And he's been in the sunlight consistently for his entire life. So, I mean, honestly, coming from somebody who has no idea what they're doing, this went pretty well for me. And yeah, that's my bonsai. This is my bonsai tree. Isn't this so crazy? I'm so, I'm so shocked. It's really cool too, because at night, his leaves will close up like this because there's no sun. And then as soon as the sun's out, it's like, whew. It's crazy to see. It's crazy. Um, but yeah, if you guys are looking to grow a bonsai tree, just do it. Just do it. It's so rewarding and it's so cool to watch. So thank you. I will give you another update in another video when he's a tree tree because right now he's still a little, little guy. But yeah, there's that for you.